all over the place. <laughs> My name is Chloe Lilac, and you're watching Deep Bites. I don't know if I did that right. Uh, hi, I'm Chloe Lilac. Uh, I'm 19 years old. I'm from Brooklyn, New York, and I make like alternative pop music, right? Probably. My upcoming two part mixtape, I mean, I think it's mostly like about, I'm 19, so it's like my last year as a teenager, but. Also, it's about like my struggle with mental health, especially because I wrote most of it in quarantine. I don't know if this is just me or anything, but like it was really, really tough on my mental health. And then also like quarantine was like, like the veil was kind of lifted on everything. And so I fell out with like a lot of different people in my life that I thought I would be friends with for a really long time. If I had unlimited budget for my next music video, I would 100% do like a stop motion. Like not to be like fucking basic, but like like a Coraline type thing. I think that would be sick. My least favorite song is High School. I just wrote it like in like 10 minutes. And if you actually listen to the lyrics, it's literally about nothing. And people love it and I, I'm grateful, but I don't know why. My favorite song is it's like a tie between Here's Your Song and Summer, I would say. Middle of July, I think I'll miss you. Staying out all night, and got shit to do on a train. Say one, someone I just love. I would say Ella Jane, she's like one of my best friends. She's awesome, dude. She's so cool. I love her. What kind of musician do I want? I guess I want to be the kind of musician those who know, know, and those who don't, don't, so I can still walk around, but I have like a great, huge fan base. So probably like, like a 2014 Tyler the Creator <laughs> would be like my sweet spot. When no one is watching, you can find me Practicing scales probably, that's really boring. I'm terrible at guitar and I'm really trying to get better. <laughs> if I could go back in time and write any song in history, it would be Heather by Conan Gray. Even though that's such like a like a recent one, I love it and I think it's like the most perfect like sad bitch like pop anthem. When the song Summer blew up, I felt surprised. I, I just never expected people to be like, this one. I was playing this like painful show <laughs> in Boston. Like everyone's just kind of standing there like looking at me. And then the last song I always play in my sets is Summer because it's a fun one to go out on. And while I'm playing Summer, this girl goes, I fucking actually know this song. <laughs> and like ran up to the front and was like jamming super hard and knew all the lyrics and was like going off and that had never happened to me before because it's like, I had only had like three songs out at that point. And then she like, she like ran up to me after I went off stage and she was like, she was like, yo, like I didn't know it was you who sang that song. And that was the moment that I was like, how's some bitch in Boston? Like, no, my fucking song that I wrote about my crush, like what? My dream tattoo would be, I really want like a, before I leave, I hang out in the cemetery near my house all the time called um, Greenwood Cemetery. I think everyone should go, it's beautiful. I really want to get like like a headstone that says Greenwood or something. I know that's like super edgy, but like, <laughs> you know, like, okay, Chloe. But like, I just hang out there and I love it. Gwen Stefani or Green Day? Green Day, hands down. I would say Manic Pixie Dream. Cowboy Boots or Converse? I would say Converse, actually, I would. DIY show or stadium show? I would say stadium. DIY, I've been there, done that. It's super fun, but. Writing or performing? That's a hard one. I would say performing, probably. I really love it. When you dropped out of college, I was the first to call you. We fought so much in high school. Still told my friends I liked you. But you're just so elitist. And it's for no good reason I think it's time we face it There's no nice way to 
just say this Fuck me up or let you back and leave me when you get a boyfriend Count him up, I'm losing track of it all There's way more than ten things I hate about you Six ways I wanna tell you too late to work it out You used to be my best friend, now there's ten things I hate about you Rich kids with daddy issues hate me, I know you do Not as much as I hate you You knew my heart was breaking when you ditched me for Nathan Told you so many times But when you say you care, yeah, you're faking And you stole my spirits Go to a party and repeat my lyrics Told you so many times But you were never concentrating Yeah, if I let you back and leave me When you get a boyfriend, count him up I'm losing track of it all there's way more than two things I hate about you Six ways I want to tell you Too late to work it out You used to be my best friend Now there's two things I hate about you Rich kids with daddy issues Hate me, I know you do Not as much as Way more, way more Way more, way more Way more, way more, way more, way more, way more, way more, way more. Mm. Oh, there's way more than two things I hate about you. Six ways I wanna tell you. Too late to work it out. You used to be my best friend. Now there's two things I hate about you. Rich kids with daddy in